The biggest issue that we've found in Michigan with iron mining is the land use, is that you are left with an open pit. There's not a lot of things you can do about it. We saw that in Minnesota as well. Try to reclaim the areas the best you can and maybe put it back into a productive uh, uh, activity as the mines are shut down. But at the, the end of the day, you still have some issues. Ultimately, our mining law, we believe, and we've talked to some of your Wisconsin regulators over here as well, relative to our law, we, we feel ours is, is flexible enough to address the very many unique issues associated with mining. Because I said, every mine is different. There's always something that's going to be a little bit different. If you have too rigid of a statute and you're, you're too prescriptive of rules, I believe those are a hindrance. The proposed Back 40 mine project, a metallic mine on the Menominee River on the Wisconsin-Michigan border, is indicative of the public opinion of this dangerous type of mining. On the Back 40 project, in addition to the overwhelming tribal opposition, six counties aligned along the waters that would be impacted have passed formal resolutions against the mine. In just those six counties, they represent over 7% to the total population of the state.